Today, we're jumping into the intriguing realm of problem solving, and we're spicing it up with the famous Ishikawa diagram, as also called fishbone diagram, the ultimate tool for root cause analysis. Diagram was developed by the Japanese professor Kaoru Ishikawa in the 1960s. Inspired by the art of Hanpukai, a traditional Japanese fishbone cuisine, Professor Ishikawa applied the concept of breaking down a fishbone into smaller parts to problem solving. This tool became a cornerstone in quality management and continues to serve as a pillar of problem solving methodologies worldwide. Just before we start explaining how to create the problem solving diagram. In description below, you may find several links for books for further reading about problem solving methods. We also share a digital template of diagram that you can use. Sharing is caring. Please share back this video in LinkedIn. Subscribe to our YouTube channel if you find value in content. Let's now move into creating a fishbone diagram. You don't have to be an artist or an expert in drawing. The simplicity of this tool is what makes it so appealing. So grab your pen and paper. Remember, in the world of decision-making, you need to hook the right cause. The Ishikawa diagram helps you identify those sneaky culprits that often swim beneath the surface, causing ripples in your plans. Begin by sketching a horizontal line that spans your paper, symbolizing the backbone of the fish with your specific problem located at the head of the fishbone. Next, consider the key categories or factors that could be contributing to your problem. These are the bones that radiate from the spine. In the realm of business, common categories might encompass people, process, equipment, materials, environment, and management. Extend lines from the spine for each of these categories. Under each category, pinpoint potential causes related to your problem. These are like the smaller bones stemming from the larger ones. For example, under people, you can list issues such as insufficient training, communication breakdowns, or staff turnover. Repeat this process for every category you've chosen. After you've listed the causes, take a step back and review your diagram. You'll likely see a pattern emerging with one or more causes standing out as the likely culprits. This visual representation can help you pinpoint the root causes of your problem. Now you're ready to swim in the right direction. Armed with the Ishikawa diagram, you'll navigate the sea of decisions with confidence, knowing that you're equipped to identify and solve problems like a pro. Until next time. Keep your tools sharp and make your business sharper.